Permafrost seems like it's just organic, but, but there are lots of subtle differences in it that you can actually smell. Okay, so permafrost dissolved organic carbon or DOC smells to me like um, fresh manure, but of the good kind. Permafrost smells like a nice, gooey bit of red. Uh, um, you know, really happy cows that are free range, vegetarian fed. Permafrost can have a grassy smell. They can have a, a very peaty smell, kind of like a very peaty scotch. So I think it smells like, like the crawl space in like a dirt basement. And uh, it's very, very metallic sort of smell. To this smells kind of like uh, foot after it has not been washed for a while. So it smelled very musty to me. So to me it's like what a good barn should smell like, like a really clean barn. I can't pinpoint exactly like where I smelled the must smell before. It smells like horses, but good. I think it smells like if you walked into a pine forest and came across a pile of manure. Okay, it was bad, but it smells bad. To me it smells kind of like when I unpack a tent or a tarp that's been really muddy but packed up in like a basement for like a year or so, getting it out for the new season. And I also get um, a smell of aged good cheese, like stinky cheese, so you know, something that's really expensive. It smells kind of like a compost pile, but if there's also manure in the compost, they can have um, a slightly metallic sense or smell to them. And you let it sit for like a few years, then, then you dug it all, you, you mixed it all up. But then once it sort of settles in to the back of your nose or even you know back of your mouth, it tastes a little bit. I get a maple syrup, which is which is also reminiscent of, of CO2. High concentrations of CO2 give some people a, meta a metallic sense, almost like some strains of mold, um, like not mold on food, but mold maybe you find in like a, a damp. Room. Mixed with that, I think there is also a real floral kind of undertone. It smells kind of like smoke and manure, um, which strangely enough smells like some scotches. A little, I got a little bit of liquid smoke, like the stuff you would maybe put in like a smoker to smoke meat, although it doesn't smell like meat at all. So each person smells it differently, and when one person smells uh, grass, another one would smell a little hint of vinegar, um, sometimes even a bit of butyric acid, which is a great. It's a highly complex and, and fun thing to do, so I encourage everyone to go out and, and smell some.